Casey Cab Horan. <laughs> I'm Judy. I'm a punk woman. I can't tell you how honored I am to be here. Thank you. Thank you. Say thank you to uh, my co star, Richard Ray Whitman, you know, for making Frankie real. So. Irene could be where she is today. So thank you to my family over this way. <laughs> they taught me what family is about so that I could bring it to the screen. I want to say thank you to the fellow nominees because my goodness, you scared the heck out of me with that talent that you showed up here. I was thinking, oh well. <laughs> You guys are totally awesome. I'm, I'm so proud to stand among you. I'm going to say thank you to Sterling Harjo for writing the stories that he writes that puts a human face on Native uh, women, Native men. And, uh, you know, we're not going to mention the age business here, but <laughs> you guys get it, right? Love comes in all ages. Human stories comes in all colors. Red happens to be among them. And I'm really, really grateful to the uh, Institute here, Michael Smith, his incredible family, the incredible volunteers, the amazing sponsors who believe in all of us. And I'm so proud of uh, standing on the same stage with Hattie Kaufman, whoa. <laughs> this is big, guys, this is real big. And then Michael Spears is all grown up. When I met him, he was playing my son in The Witness, right? Oh, he's so cute when you saw him. <laughs> Turned out pretty good, too, huh? I'll say congratulations uh, to everyone. And if there's anyone I've forgotten, you know, please overlook me. It's an exciting time for me. And uh, of course, you know, my mom and daddy are on the other side, so I want to say leave the hapahangade to those who have come before me that would allow me to be a strong red woman and to represent. Leave the hapahangade.